Canva newsletter tutorial how to create a newsletter with Canva step by step. Hi, good day, and welcome to another video. Today, we will be talking about newsletter and how can you create beautiful newsletter easily and for free on Canva. So, first, what is newsletter? It is a letter report containing news concerning the business activities or event that is sent to customers and why you need to send newsletter to your customers. Because in order for you to get good customer for your business, you need to stay connected with them by letting them know about your business updates, promotions, new products, or you can even send them tips on how to use your products properly or in a best way. Something like that can help your business to grow and also just to remain connected with your customers and let them feel that they can connect with you or with your business. And another reason for newsletter, it helps you drive more traffic to your new contents or new products. You know, if you have new products or contents to release online, you can send them newsletter informing them about it. Or if they missed something, you can send them newsletter checking if they are aware of the update that you have in your business. So newsletter is very essential and it's a must to do if you have a business online because the business competition online is now highly increasing and to stay on the top, you need to connect with your customers for them to stay with you because if not, then they might go to your competitor and you'll be having hard time of getting them back. And of course, when you send newsletter, it should be beautiful, attractive, and look professional for your customers to really check on it and believe it that it's real. And with that, Canva can really help you create an amazing newsletter. To start with, just go to canva.com and you can just simply create an account by providing your email. And since I already got my account, so let me log in. And this is the uh, Canva dashboard. So now let's check the different ways on how Canva helps you create newsletter in an easy and better way. So first way, by the way, Canva can be connected directly to your MailChimp. MailChimp is one of the best email marketing tools used by many businesses. So Canva has this integration to MailChimp. It means you can create your newsletter design on Canva and you can directly establish it on MailChimp content library for you to easily send it to all your customers from your email list. I will show you how you can do it. So for example, this is your designs for a newsletter, just assuming. And from here, just click these three dots and under share, click the see all menu. And from down here, you can see MailChimp. And to connect, just click connect and it will ask you to log in to your MailChimp account. So make sure you already have a MailChimp account created. And if you don't use MailChimp, then that's still fine. You can make use of any other email marketing. So you just need to download your design and upload it manually to the library of your email marketing tools that you are currently using. And also you can share it to different social media account like Facebook and Instagram. So you have a lot of option here to share your design directly. And now let's try to create newsletter for free. Just going back to our Canva dashboard over here, you can see different options to select from. If what design you want to create, you have presentation, social media, video, print projects, marketing, office, and more. So just go to marketing since newsletter is one of the marketing strategy or simply search it here, email newsletter and just select the right one. And over here, you have options to select different templates or create with blank newsletter. And here, some of the templates are available only for a premium or pro account, but you can still find a lot of free templates here that you can use for your designs. Let me just select this because me, I like to start selecting templates and then change everything after that. So over here, as we can see, this templates has two pages. So you can create newsletter with two pages or one page that is up to you. As you can see, the design is look good and look decent. 
So we already selected our template and with that you can remove anything from here that you like to change and add another elements or shape if you like. And you can also change the size of the elements that you added. And you can add lines, shapes, graphics, charts, table, and many more. Just choose elements that will suit your brand and you can adjust the opacity of the elements. For example, we added this element and adjust the transparency. And you may change the color of the elements here too. And by clicking the right side of your mouse, you can arrange your elements if what elements to be in front and back. You may also add text and choose different font style. So let me go ahead and bring the design that I just created. So this is the simple newsletter that I just created, but you can do more than this. So here I just added text, image, money elements here and short description about this newsletter. You can just easily drag and drop some elements from here on your left side and bring it to your design. And here I would like to show you, you can also add clickable link here in your design. Like when your recipient or your customer receive this newsletter, they can click this button so that they are able to further check the details or information of the newsletter. So let's first add some elements to make this look like a button. Let's add this and let's add additional icons showing that this is clickable. And let's group this first. So we have a frame here. So let's lock our frame first so that we cannot make any changes or move this. And now let's highlight these elements and text again and group them as one. After that, click these three dots and look for this chain icon to add link. And with that, you can just copy and paste your link here where you wanted your subscribers or customers routed to when they click this button for more information. And after that, you can establish it directly to your MailChimp library or if you are using different email marketing tools, then just download it as PNG or JPEG and manually upload it to your email marketing tools library but I suggest that you will download the design as JPEG and not PNG because PNG size is more higher than JPEG so when you uh, post this one and the connection of the receiver is not that good so it will take a few minutes for your design to show up on the customer side so JPEG is better for your customer to easily open your email newsletter and see your design more faster compared to PNG. And that's all for today's video. If you have any questions, just comment down below. And thank you for watching.